It's show time! <laughs> <laughs> oh god, oh god, he's pissed, he's pissed, he's pissed! Tornado or what? I should kick your f***ing ass! Chance of rain 50%. Keep index values up to 100 early in the evening. The National Weather Service in St. Louis has issued a flash flood warning for Lincoln County, St. Charles County, Northeastern Warren County, until 7.15 a.m. At 1.16 a.m., Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Between 1 and 4 inches of rain have fallen. Additional rainfall amounts of 2 to 4 inches are possible in the warned area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Expected hazards include flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. The following impacts are expected. Flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include O'Fallon, St. Charles, St. Peter's, Chesterfield, Wildwood, Woodsville, Maryland Heights, Lake St. Louis, Gardein Prairie, Troy, Warrington, Weldon Spring, White City, Cotlin Hill, St. Paul, Moscow Mills, Winfield, Davis, Jonesburg, and Truesdale. This includes the following state parks, Quiver River State Park and First Missouri State Capitol Historic Site. This includes the following highways, Interstate 70 in Missouri between exits 188 and 229. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Repeating, a flash flood warning has been issued until 7.15 a.m. for the following counties in Missouri, Lincoln, St. Charles, and Warren. Thunderstorms. Source, radar. The following impacts are expected. Flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include St. Louis, Belleville, Granite City, O'Fallon, Alton, East St. Louis, Collinsville, Edwardsville, Fairview Heights, Cahokia, Swansea, Glen Carbon, Shiloh, Wood River, Highland, Troy, Waterloo, Columbia, Ythalto, and Maryville. This includes the following state parks, Horseshoe Lake State Park. This includes the following highways, Interstate 64 in Illinois between exits 9 and 27. Interstate 55 in Illinois near exit 23. Interstate 70 in Illinois between exits 21 and 30. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Be especially cautious at night when it is harder to recognize the dangers of flooding. Repeating, a flash flood warning has been issued until 8.45 a.m. for the following counties, in Illinois, Madison, Monroe and St. Clair.
Additional rainfall amounts of 1 to 3 inches are possible in the warm area. Flash flooding is already occurring. This is a flash flood emergency for Creve Core, Frontenac, Ladue, and Maryland Heights. This is a particularly dangerous situation. See higher ground now. Expected hazards include life threatening flash flooding, thunderstorms producing flash flooding. Severe weather has been confirmed by law enforcement reported. The following impacts are expected. This is a particularly dangerous situation. See higher ground now. Life threatening flash flooding of low water crossings, small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets, and underpasses. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include St. Louis, St. Charles, Florissant, Chesterfield, University City, Kirkwood, Maryland Heights, Hazelwood, Webster Groves, Ferguson, Creepcore, Overland, Clayton, Cahokia, Jennings, St. Anne, Crestwood, Richmond, Bellefontaine, Neighbors, and Town and Country. This includes the following state parks, Scott Joplin Historic Site, this includes the following highways, Interstate 70 in Missouri near exit 231. This includes the following streams and drainages. The following is a summary of... Expected to begin shortly. Expected hazards include flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source, radar. The following impacts are expected. Flash flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets, and underpasses, as well as other poor drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flash flooding include Alton, Yafalco, Litchfield, Stunton, Gillespie, East Alton, Brighton, Mount Olive, Bunker Hill, Bernal, Morton, Livingston, Alhambra, Shipman, Wilsonville, Sawyerville, Mount Clare, East Gillespie, East Garville, and Berrytown. This includes the following state parks, Beaver Dam State Park. This includes the following highways, Interstate 55 of Illinois between exit 30 and 52. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Be aware of your surroundings and do not drive on flooded roads. Repeating, a flash flood warning has been issued until 12.45 p.m. for the following counties in Illinois, Cleveland, Madison, and Montgomery. Amber Alert, the following message is transmitted at the request of the Illinois State Police. At the request of the Maywood Police Department, the Illinois Amber Alert notification system has been activated. The Maywood Police have confirmed a child abduction that occurred at 1701 South 1st Avenue, Maywood. Kiara Montgomery is a black female, 3 years old, 3 feet tall and weighs 30 pounds with short black hair and brown eyes. She was last seen wearing a pig blouse and maroon pants during ADCFS visitation with the suspect Henry Kay. Davis, black female, 31, 5 feet 4 inches and weighs 152 pounds. Shayna was last seen wearing a black and white dress. Kiara is listed as a protected party from the suspect in an active order of protection. DCSS reported that Kiara was forced by the suspect into a silver 2021 Honda inside driven by an unknown black female. Last seen heading northbound from 1st Avenue, Maywood at 9.53 a.m. Anyone with information should call 911. This concludes the Amber Alert issued by the Illinois State Police. A child abduction that occurred at 1701 South First Avenue, Lee. Kiara Montgomery is a black female, three years old, three feet tall, and weighs 30 pounds with short black hair and brown eyes. She was last seen wearing a pink blouse and maroon pants during ADCFS visitation with the suspect Shayna Kay. Davis, black female, 31, five feet four inches, and weighs 152 pounds. Shayna was last seen wearing a black and white dress. Kiara is listed as a protected party from the suspect in an active order of protection. DCFS reported that Kiara was forced by the suspect into a silver 2021 Honda Insight driven by an unknown black female. 
Last seen heading northbound from 1st Avenue, Maywood at 9.53 a.m. Anyone with information should call 911. This concludes the Amber Alert issued by the Illinois State Police. What? What? Okay. 93.3 to the weekly. What the fuck? Okay.